Hey everybody, welcome back to Spill the Greens. My name's Aaron and I'm the Director of Horticulture here at Eden Green Technology. As you can see behind me, vertical farming has risen to great heights in the past few years. New technologies, systems, and tools are allowing growers all over the world to use new techniques, growing better plants anywhere. All this new technology exists, but we're not quite sure how to use it. Sure, we can grow you the biggest, best, most expensive head of lettuce, but not everybody wants to pay for that. It's not sustainable and it's not economical. So how do we use these tools in a perfect way to bring the perfect product to people everywhere? We use data. We like to make data-driven decisions. That way, everything we do is backed up by research and experience that we've done here at our farms. Growers all over the world are using this data to affect the climate and the light and the nutrients to get better, to get more sustainable, and to be more efficient. That data also allows us to include automation into our systems. The decision to be fully automated is an expensive one and should not be taken lightly. But when implemented correctly, every greenhouse in the world can benefit from some form of automation. As an example of some of this great technology, I'm standing on a fully automated high-tech fertigation system. This system runs 24-7, completely autonomous, allowing us to give the plants exactly what they need all the time without a lot of babysitting. It's a great system and fully dependable. And it's just one of the many systems that allow us to automate our growing in our greenhouse. Another method we use is implementing new growing systems. The systems that we use around the world are very different. NFTs, vertical systems, indoor, greenhouses, some a combination of outdoor and indoor. The sky is the limit on the type of methods you can use, and there's a place for all of these methods. At Eden Green, we have developed a proprietary system that allows us to grow vertical in a greenhouse, something that had never been done before. And as we develop our methods to be better and more sustainable and more efficient, we'll be bringing you a clean, safe product in a shorter amount of time. And that's what we're all trying to do. We're all trying to work together to bring a total solution to the food problems around the world, no matter where they are or what they are, to benefit everyone. After talking about all this data and data-driven decisions, it's important to remember not to let the best get in the way of the good. It's a mantra that I like to include every day. When we have all these new technologies and implements, I wanna make sure that I'm growing a good enough product that's best for my customer, not the best biggest head of lettuce. And hopefully someday they can be one and the same. Until then, we'll keep working at this. Thanks for joining us today on Spill the Greens. Feel free to leave your comments and questions below and we'll see you next time.